Very good afternoon to you, Priscilla, but it's not the best of afternoons here at uh, Nakabogo Zone. That's in our Kiso district where today a 34-year-old woman has been shot dead by uh, security operatives. Uh, and uh, Jacqueline uh, Nalwanga, now the deceased, up to now, the family doesn't know where the body has been taken. And according to one of the sons that we spoke to earlier uh, in the morning, they were going to the, to the garden this morning, and all of a sudden, they bumped into some security operatives who had mounted an operation and with the intention of arresting uh, some of uh, the residents here. But uh, uh, the son says they were scared, him and the mom, and uh, they raised an alarm on seeing armed personnel whom they didn't know in the area. And in the process, one of the security operatives told them to shut up. And uh, later on, uh, after that, then the security operative uh, reportedly shot the mom who, who fell on the ground. And then he came and then to actually find out what had, uh, what had uh, really happened. And then he moved away. So the son raised an alarm, but uh, he couldn't be helped. And uh, they called the, the dad, who is the husband of uh, the late Jacqueline Naluanga, that's uh, Kenneth Waswa, who came back. He had gone to work. He came back. And uh, there was a scuffle as he tried to tell the security operatives uh, to take the, uh, the wife to hospital, maybe she could survive. Uh, he narrates that uh, they took her, his wife in uh, a car, in a vehicle commonly known as the drone, and before they reached hospital, uh, she passed on. But at the moment, uh, he says uh, they went to Nakasero, and uh, the security operatives uh, forced him out of the vehicle, and uh, he went to the mortuary, went to different hospitals, trying to search where the body of uh, his late uh, wife would be, but she was nowhere, the body was nowhere to be found. So right here, this is the home of uh, uh, the late Nakabogo and uh, the home of uh, Kenneth Waswa. As you can see, already a vigil is already underway with some people uh, gathered here waiting to see what really goes on. And uh, we are yet to talk to the police to ascertain more details about this shooting and where the body of uh, the late Jacqueline Nakabogo is. So from here, we're going to be heading to the police to find out, to tell us what really happened and where is the body of the late Nakabugo. Let me just get back to you in studio. We shall be giving you more details in our subsequent bulletins, NTV Akawungezi and NTV Tonight. From me, Ali Mivole, back to you, Priscilla.